Good Monday morning. So let's see. I should make this fast because I do need to get to work at some point. I thought I found an interesting discovery this morning. I'm kind of bombed. So I was pulling out my new Esperanza palette to, to try that. And I, I started with a look that just came out real, so bad because I didn't have the right crease color that I just took it off and started again. But here's what I discovered. So I was pulling out, this is the Esperanza palette. And guess what I found? Um, Urban Decay palette with even with a skull on it, which is kind of weird that this is so similar. Which one is this? Um, I don't know. They don't put it on, unfortunately. But it's the Skull Palette one. But check this out. It's almost the same colors. Uh, Urban Decay has two more. But... They're so similar. They're like dupes. Like Urban Decay and Kat Von D. So, ah, Urban Decay has a sparkly purple. Um, remember, I got the Kat Von D palette pretty much for that beautiful purple. Urban Decay's has a sparkly purple. Gunmetal, the Urban Decay has a gunmetal. Bronze. The Urban Decay has a bronze. <laughs> highlighter color. The Urban Decay has a highlighter. Polyester Bride. So um, here's the purple. Um, the bronze. Purple is Grifter. The bronze. There's a couple in here. There's this one there's another one so oh and blue the urban decay has this bright blue shatter which actually i'm wearing on my lids today and the kat von d has that bright blue which i'm sure is not as good as the urban decay so I'm bummed now. <laughs> so again, Urban Decay, I mean Kat Von D and Urban Decay. So I think the Kat Von D palette is a dupe. <sighs> because pretty much the color scheme is the same except for one or two colors here and there. Isn't that weird? And what's really weird is they both have the skulls on them. <laughs> That is so bizarre. Hmm. Well, Kat Von D is not as good as the Urban Decay. I can tell you that. But, um, I don't know. I'll have to play around with them more. Um, I was playing around with stuff this morning. It was kind of interesting. I, um, pulled out my NARS cheek palette from a couple years ago and used this beautiful pink. Let's see what color that is. Angelica. This is all about cheek palette. So I don't use it very often, so I wanted to use it. So I use this one, Angelica, today. Can you see it, really? Probably not. But I like how that came out. So, and I have my Viva Glam, Mac Viva Glam Rihanna on. I'm sure it won't last all day, but <laughs> I put it on just just for fun. So I wanted to share about that little discovery I made this morning. Isn't that weird? Um, they're probably around the same price. There's a sneak peek online about Urban Decay coming out with a palette this summer, and I really hope they do, called Electric. It's not supposed to be known yet, but um, it's all really, really bright. My favorite. Bright, bright colors. If you Google online, you'll find it. Urban De Decay Electric Palette. I'm hoping to see that this summer. 
So, yeah, the things on my wish list now are that Urban Decay Electric when it comes out and the Becca products. I'm sure there'll be more. Summer collections are my favorite. So, that's all for this morning. I hope you have a great Monday, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.